This is your update three on Tropical Storm Bud. The information on the storm you can see as of two o'clock Eastern time on Thursday, June 13, 14, 2018. Location of the storm is 21.4 degrees north, 109.5 degrees west. The winds are 45 miles an hour and the pressure is 1,000 millimeters on the dock. The movement of the storm is north, northwest at seven miles an hour. You can see on the map that tropical storm warnings are indicated by the blue and they stretch from for a good decent part of the Baja. I'm guessing between 50 and 100 miles. And Bud will make landfall tonight. Tonight in the Baja Peninsula near Cabo San Lucas. Here's the track of the storm. You can see that by 12 a.m. tomorrow or yeah, midnight tonight, it's going to make landfall in the southern tip of the Baja Peninsula. Then by 12 p.m. tomorrow, it will emerge off the, um, off the Baja, and then by Saturday, it will make landfall on the mainland of Mexico and spread moisture into the southwest United States. Much needed rain is going to fall there. Sea surface temperatures where the storm is are leveling off significantly and it's not really going to impact the storm at all. It's just the storm's going to weaken no matter what because of land interaction. But then ahead of the storm, waters are very warm, so that may interfere with the storm a little bit, but I doubt it. Even though it might strengthen a tiny bit, not enough because it's not in the open water. So Bud with wind shear is very low where the storm is now. Ahead of it, it's pretty high, but it's not increasing nor decreasing. But the storm, that's probably why it will weaken. It's going to weaken no matter what because of land interaction. Satellite imagery is very close to land. Very, very close. The center of the storm still has an eye. It's just not organized. It has a well-defined center and the thunderstorms are, and showers are already um, impacting the Baja, but the eye wall has not arrived yet, even though it's probably not super, super strong. But um, people will probably need to be prepared for this, even though they're, they should be prepared. And then inland Mexico's got another day to prepare for it, but they should be prepared for this as well as in the south, south, southwest in the United States. Here are the hurricane names. You can see we've gone through Valletta and Bud. The next name is Carlotta, followed by Daniel and Amelia. You can see that Esther in the Philippine region has been used because of Tropical Depression 8W. We will see if Gamey and Prataroon form any day now. If you need more details, you should visit the NOAA website or download the free app at the link below. There might be another update on Tropical Storm Bud tomorrow, which will be Friday, June 15, 2018. Thank you for watching this video and prepare for this storm.